Hey guys, so a couple weeks ago we went to the county fair up where we live and um, they were doing an event and we had the opportunity to go out and catch a chicken. So, so we did and we named her Goldie. She is over here, <laughs> in here somewhere. Let's see if she will say hi. There she is. There's Miss Goldie. So Miss Goldie, we caught her at the fair. And um, our other chickens down there. And all of you. They do not want to be friends with her. And so I've been dealing with her, trying to make friends. And then we also have a broody hen right there. And for those of you who do not know what a broody hen is, it is a hen that wants to hatch babies, but because we do not have a rooster, um, the eggs will not hatch. So some hens go to the point of not eating or drinking because they want to hatch the eggs so bad. So that's what I've been dealing with today. We've got that, that one right there, over there. Yep, there she is. And then we got this one in here. That's what we got going on today. And these lovely ladies do not want to make friends with her. No, they don't. Come here. No, you won't come here. Yep. So those are all the hens that don't want to be friends with her, especially you. No, you're one of the nicest ones there. Yes. Yep. So we got all of them. Oh, look, see, they don't want to be friends with her. Hopping from bar to bar, are you, Goldie? Miss Broody. Come on. Come here. Come here. Come here. So what you want to do with a broody hen, hey Goldie. With a broody hen, you want to try to remove them if your eggs are not fertile. You want to try to remove them um, as fast as you can so then they don't get into that problem of um, essentially killing themselves because they won't be eating or drinking. So what you can do to help with that is you can um, you can put her in essentially a timeout or chicken jail and you can um, quarantine her to try to get her out of that habit. And you can also um, put something cold under her like an ice pack or a frozen water. And um, that will help break the broodiness or you could just keep taking them in and out and that will work too hello ladies um so yeah those you can do all of those things or you can just deal with it or you could get a rooster so yeah well, then hiding in the boxes get it come here goldie i know sweetie i know come here mm -hmm. so we got her just hiding away what do you got to say? Do you like camera? You, you do? Don't peck my phone. So, yeah. So, I've been trying to get her to be friends with um, the other hens. But they just don't want to get along. Then she goes and she hides in the chicken coop. Where nobody is, huh? Is that what you do? Is that what you do? So, trying to take out that broody hen can be difficult. They can get... Um, a little aggressive at times. I don't really want to you. They can get a little aggressive at times, but um, they shouldn't hurt you. They might just peck at you, but you won't do anything. They'll get mad at you and they'll do this weird balking thing. But that's only because they're saying, "Hey, get away from my eggs. I don't. I want to see her." You. You want to say hi? Yeah. So those are some ways you can take care of Broody Hen. And let's try and see if we can get her to be friends. Trying to take care of you. Got all these meanie heads out here. And you're hiding on my foot. Because you know no one wants to come by mama right now, huh? Look at that. Everybody else sat there. And you're hiding on me. While I'm trying to take care of you. <laughs> 